Good evening, friends. Good evening, humans. I'm addressing only to humans or friends of humans. As of now, I will not address a single word to dark ones, to freaky ones, to all the alien species that were roaming the earth, inside of the earth, and around the of the earth for many, many millennia. Question for today is why do we need secrecy? Why do we need so many secret agencies? Why do we need a myriad of jobs within a spy community? And they are so proud, they are spying. For the sake of what? Who gave them a right to do this? Who gave these, let's call it half humans or hybrids or let's call it non, non-human entities to go around and judge others how they live their life by spying, by instigating, are they living properly by the code or legal code that was written by another group of crooks, let's call it lawyers, advocates, judges, lawmakers and so on. They're just lawmakers, they're not creators of any kind. They're just silent oppressors of the rest of the not free humanity. So title for today is like this. To keep the secrets or to twist the truth. So at the present moment, you have basically a choice to completely allow that you've been spy on, you've been controlled, you've been manipulated, you've been programmed, yet living in an ignorance as majority of humans do, we do nothing about it. We do absolutely nothing about it because we think it's normal. We assume that this is something, let's call it God-given. Why somebody else has the rights to peek into your wallet, peek into your accounts or peek into your life or listen your conversations, reading your private thoughts, even if you put them on the Facebook or even you put them anywhere else. So, do we have to be con- concerned for this? Absolutely yes, because this society is turning very rapidly into Aurelians, not even Aurelian, Aurelian on third degree. 33rd degree of another secret level that nobody want to talk about yet this is the one side of the this very dirty coin another side is twisting the truth they're already out so David Dyke says something that it's not to likings of majority of these elite dark elite who's controlling the finances who's controlling the rest of the population. So what I can do? They cannot undo this. So the things they do is ridiculizing him. This is proven. Challenge him. Troll him to, to incredible amounts of false information coming about his very, very decent and, and honest doings for the rest of the humanity. They can block him not to speak, they can prevent him to earn very decent living by selling his books, by selling his speeches. So you have to choose, do you continue being ignorant or meaning that you don't even want to see that you've been spied on in every aspect through not only 
government officials. Now the government hand extended through Google, YouTube, Facebook, and all the other tools that are online, like internet tools or broad platforms, where they censor you even more. And you pretend that you live in a some kind of free world when you can say whatever you want, call your amendment uh, number one of your free speech. What does it mean, free speech to talk and nobody else can hear you? This is not free speech. This is prevented to come out the truth of yours. And this is your truth. Not mine, not anybody else's. So if you want to talk to a mass group of people, you shouldn't be prevented whatsoever. The second side of the coin is the media. Their information is leaking out. Doesn't matter, WikiLeaks, Snowdance, and many other brave beings who are here. Trump now, and they still, Trump is the President of the United States, and they still treat him as, I cannot even say that the words how media, this mainstream, fake stream media is treating him. As somebody who's actually an enemy of the, the planet, an enemy of the United States, yet it's all reverse. So when they're pointing finger and calling somebody a liar, the rest of three fingers are pointing to them. So they are the biggest liars of all. So why are they twisting this truth? What is behind this obsessive behavior that comes from the history? That even the history that we're reading, the knowledge that you think that you know about Holocaust, about Einstein about uh, Hitler and so on are lies, are twisted, let's call it truth, most of them are lies. So, how to deal with this? With your ignorance? I don't think so, because this will hurt you. And it will hurt you faster and faster, because if you do not start discerning what is really happening around you, you become a part of this dark machine that will be wiped out of the planet. It will be wiped out. So, my suggestion, just suggestion, you get in line for breadcrumbs if you don't do anything else, if you continue living in an ignorance, if you continue feeding yourself and your leftovers of your soul with the fake news media and you do nothing about it. When somebody blindly lying about Trump and accusing Trump for doing everything opposite of what he's actually doing for Americans and saving the world not to push NATO more into deeper wars that they are actually doing until now. So he's preventing all this and you're still calling him all different names. So this will be your demise. And when I say these things, they are actually, they were heard. They are heard all over the universe. We're not alone. We're not alone on this planet, pure humanity with some fake aliens coming around. No, there are real aliens who are here and who are controlling every aspect of your life. Yet what to do about this? Sit in your comfortable chair with a remote in your hand, do absolutely nothing will cost you everything, will cost you every single piece of your soul. But if this is where you want to be, so be it. It's your, let's call it, free choice, which is actually implemented fake free choice in your head that you are actually free. You have a free elections. Now, Pen, Le Pen had a huge victory over this stupid moron who are representing the, the banksters. Yet, what I see 12 hours later, the things are coming out how the, the elections were completely stolen. Yet, isn't going to stop Le Pen and many other free French people who are 
absolutely ready to raise a total revolution against the banksters. Now they will get it in their face with very legal techniques. So don't, don't take my word, just sit and wait for a couple of months to see what's going to happen with Macron, where he's going to end up, which kind of jail cell he's going to get. They will not cut his head off or they will not hang him upside down of the tree. They will put him in the, in the cell and will be televised everywhere for you to know that these, not only you, to everybody to know that these creatures cannot continue roaming this planet anymore. So, what about secrecy and spying technologies that we so keen about? This is developing to take the antivirus uh, tool that it will prevent for 1,300 viruses, but they will implement another 2-3 malware that will just mess up completely your system. It will be exposed with everything else. What I do with my things, I just openly share whatever I, I do. I don't protect my computers from any of these things because they cannot hurt. My computers, my informations are true. And there is a difference. I know that they are true and they cannot manipulate it anymore. They could try to hide me, that I don't exist. They tried to kill me, they did. But again, I'm here, so what? So what I can do, the rest. They don't dare to manipulate my stories because these are the stories that are actually affecting only them. If they touch them, they're exposed. If they don't touch them, they're exposed. So. I'm just giving you, let's call it a human who has an urge to live freely, not to be afraid to say your truth. Many, many, many beautiful channels are coming. YouTube is actually dying down, but many other channels, they are like a TV, uh, radio channels. Some are presented off YouTube, but many others are coming from a couple of new uh, platforms very new very free yet it's up to you to find them out and the better thing you have to find enough courage in you to tell your truth finally and not to be afraid that there will be some kind of penalties so what it's somebody else's penalty at the present moment that you have to live with less money in your pocket because they this is at the moment they can control they can control their finances yet you'll see in a matter of months the bitcoin and uh, cryptocurrencies and many other changes from the governmental free governmental uh, offices like russia like ireland like uh, iceland like america now not fully free yet but as soon as it's fruit is ripe, Trump will bite it and will show everybody how rotten was within. So don't get surprised too much by the truth because the truth will piss you off so much yet know that it will free you forever.